Angelo here, welcome to my channel, and welcome back viewers of my stream. Guys, this will be one, technically one of the first ones I do for Path of Exile, but this is a 3.13.2 patch notes. Now obviously this is not a patch that is going to happen for 3.14, which will be taking place uh, sometime in the next two weeks. I believe they said nine days or so, but they posted this on the 29th, so I just missed it yesterday at 1.53 p.m. And basically... In preparation for our 3.14 expansion, we've been working on an engine patch to help improve performance. So, something that a lot of games do not do anymore is make a performance patch or a, a just quality of life patch. And honestly, I'm blown away. Now, again, I have I have not played this game until this month. <laughs> I think it was March 5th that Mono and I started playing this game just super casually and then just turned out that this game is fucking awesome and hey I'm, I'm i'm in they got me so we plan we're planning to deploy this patch by the end of the working week but they're saying likely tomorrow i was gonna say so maybe like friday um but yeah he's like oh maybe likely tomorrow so today i'll be sick in the meantime we've prepared a preview of the patch notes for you which you can check out below uh please note that the patch notes below may be changed prior to the deployment now, all these that I'm reading right now are pretty awesome. Like, we got uh, texture streaming has been further improved. Um, loading should be quicker, and you should see a few fewer lower resolution textures. I don't know if some of you guys would play, and right when you start the game, you would load up, and it would just kind of look like dull, look like donkey poo, all right? Like, being as nice as possible. Uh, <laughs> but I guess they fixed that. Cool. Next thing up, we got uh, added automaton. To remove old minimap. Or, my bad, automaton. Added automation to remove old minimap and shader data. This process occurs during the Grinding Gear Logos video upon uh, launch and may take some time. Old minimap and shader data will typically be cleared once per league in the future. Nice. Okay, so basically, I guess they're gonna just purge out whatever, like, clutter is in the game. Uh, next, we got. Um Updated the patcher to reduce ggpk fragmentation uh, during patching process. This means that the ggpk file won't grow so large so quickly. In the future, we're working on a graphical interface to the pack check tool so that you can easily condense it back down. Uh, again, sounds like quality of life. I'm not exactly sure what it means, but it seems like whatever their install file was, they made it like super big, like good number of gigabytes. Now they're going to slow it down and, you know, shrink it down. Dig it. See here. <clears throat> All or owners of M1 Max can now play Path of Exile through Rosetta with minimal impact on performance. A native version will be available in the future. So I'm assuming uh, for people that play on like Macintosh and whatnot, it's uh, kind of sketchy. So you probably have to run a third party program, which would there be Rosetta. And it's, you know, because it's kind of like running Windows on Mac. You can do it. And probably that's what the thing allows you to run. Uh, Path of Exile on a Mac, or an M1 Mac, whatever that is. Next, uh, various render systems has been roughly 15-20% to 20 faster, which doesn't necessarily translate to performance improvement for all users, but anecdotally, it seems like around 5% faster on average for us. Cool. I mean, he's saying not everybody's gonna notice it or see it, but hey, awesome. And fix the common client crash. Now, I don't know if you guys have this problem, but sometimes I, I would just crash. I'd just be like... Well, that sucks. But there we go. Alright guys, so that's the news. And this is just a preview. So what this means is that there's probably more. Or they're going to go further in depth. This is just kind of like, hey guys, this is what we're working on. If this is the full thing, that alone is good. If there's more than this, even better. But there you guys go. That'll be my first patch notes breakdown. Even though it's only a preview. Like I said, it's not the complete one. Thank you guys very much for watching. And I'll see you guys out there. Later. Freeze! Who are you? What are you doing here? Hold your fire! I'm a human!